Senior Congress leader Ghulam Nabi Azad, long upset with the party's resigned from a key party post in Jammu and Kashmir, signalling well what could be yet another rebellion brewing within the Congress party. He was made the chairman of the party's campaign committee and stepped down from the post shortly after he was appointed. He has also resigned from the party's Jammu and Kashmir Political Affairs uh, Committee. Sources indicated that Azad saw the appointment as a demotion as he is already a member of the party's All India Political Affairs uh, Committee. A veteran leader, he is also a former chief minister of the erstwhile state, served as a union minister and held many important party posts, Rishika. Well, absolutely. He was a member of the G23. And let's go right across uh, to NDTV Sunil Prabhu, who's joining us with the very latest on this. Sunil. What are you picking up, uh, Gulam Nabi Azad quitting uh, from that uh, important position just hours after he was inducted? He's clearly uh, unhappy with several of those appointments. Well, he's uh, quite clear that uh, the uh, uh, decision why he's uh, doing it, he cited health reasons. Uh, of course, as you rightly pointed out, uh, he's already in the uh, uh, Congress Working Committee, also an advisory body which Sonia Gandhi had constituted as the political advisory committee. <laughs> he's served uh, four or five uh, prime ministers. He think, feels that uh, uh, he's uh, uh, quite uh, big for this kind of a job of being a chairman of the political affairs committee of a union territory of uh, Kashmir, uh, Jammu and Kashmir, uh, which has now been made a union territory. And in that backdrop, he feels uh, that uh, he doesn't really fit the bill. Uh, never having said that, his own loyalists have been appointed uh, as uh, the uh, uh, you know the president of the uh, Jammu and Kashmir uh, uh, party, the uh, state unit, and it's in that context. We'll have to wait and see uh, what he does. Uh, there have been uh, reports from Kashmir uh, that some MLAs have been unhappy with the decision of appointing uh, Mr. Azad's uh, loyalist as the uh, PCC chief. Uh, some of them have resigned. Uh, there is definitely a lot of rumbling. Uh, but as of now, Mr. Gulab Nabi Azad, who's a key uh, G23 member, or one of those dissenters, uh, has uh, decided uh, to stay away uh, from uh, uh, being uh, the chairman of the uh, uh, you know, campaign committee uh, Jammu and Kashmir, uh, as, you well, as you are well aware, is due for elections uh, later next year. Uh, once, of course, that revision of roles takes place and it's in that backdrop, uh, we'll have to wait uh, and see uh, how things play out. But uh, definitely the Congress uh, making that appointment and seeing uh, this uh, embarrassment taking place. Sure. Uh, Sunil, has there been any official reaction from the Congress party over this very high-profile uh, uh, exit? Well, uh, the, uh, as of now, officially, Mr. Azad hasn't sent that letter. It's expected uh, to be uh, given shortly. And, uh, of course, uh, they, were, uh, uh, they will definitely speak to him and try to see how this can be uh, resolved. But since he feels that he's too big for this position and citing health reasons, uh, they will definitely have to look at alternatives.